Hello YouTube, Psycho Fox here. Today we're going to have a quick look at the AMX mouse and accompanying AMX desktop program for the Amstrad PCW8256 and 8512. Comes in a nice little rollable mouse. Uh, quite stylish, I think you'll uh, agree. Much better than this other one I've got, which has the word mouse written across it. And the buttons are labelled. And is about a foot thick. Missing the ball, that one. But this is a nice little mouse and it is joined to the interface on the back of the PCW there. So this is my third attempt at trying to get this running. Let's see if I have any more luck this time. Okay. As always we need to load the CPM operating system by inserting the CPM disk. There's the familiar horizontal bars. Not sure why this isn't working. I'm getting it all to load. It's just the mouse is not very responsive. I've tried it with a couple. I've just given it a good clean. Let's have a go. Put the AMX desk top disk in and type desk and enter. And it'll give you a lovely green window style desktop. There we go. Quite reminiscent of our uh, early Apple Mac or something as well. Ah, oh, that's much better. It's working now. See the mouse moving. I've not got much room to play with here. But there's the mouse. Nice three button mouse. So it pretty much gives it a much more um, user friendly interface you can see we've got disk A which is that there disk B which is the lower drive there and disk M which is the internal memory and we've got a phone icon, a calendar icon, a memo icon and a dustbin as well oh dear I wish I had a mouse mat I wish I had a mouse mat so here's the phone icon and double click that let's bring it up an address book and the only number in it at the moment is the company that made the software surprisingly because I've not entered anything so we'll click on the top left to get rid of that so oh dear I'll just roll the roller boy roll the ball by hand I think Let's go to memo. Double click on memo. Memo pad. Hello. This is a memo. Right. So when we've got that, what can we do with it? Who knows? What that little um, a little bit at the bottom there does. Does that reduce it? And it just makes it appear and reappear for some reason. I don't know. Ah, enter memo. Let's save it as. Let's save it as. Dave memo. And enter. Now where's it putting Dave memo? It's probably saved it to the memory drive M. Let's have a look. No, it's not there. Has it saved it to the disk? Ah, there it is. Dave Memo.
So let's say we want to bin that memo now. Can we drag and drop? We can. We can drag and drop on this old computer. Yeah, you would be able to normally move the mouse a bit better than this, but I've not got any room to move the mouse. Click go to permanently erase this file. Go. So that's got rid of Dave Memo from the disk. And we can close that down. Really need a mouse map for this. So, let's have a look what's under special. Not a lot. Edit. So, it's a nice little Windows style program that came with a mouse. I remember my dad owned this back, back in the late 80s. Let's have a look at the calendar and see what year it is. It's Monday the 15th of June 1987. Does that let you type little entries? Yes. If you want to type in birthday, you can save someone's birthday to a date. That's useful. I've heard actually this year, this year counter isn't very really useful. Let's click to see how far up it'll go. And it goes to 1999 and then <laughs> goes back around to 1980. We obviously didn't think this would be used after 1999. And why wouldn't it be? It's absolutely brilliant. Who needs a PC when you've got the AMX desktop? I was a fun. Thanks for watching.